Okay, I know this isn't going to focus right, but I'm going to try it anyway. Um, I probably need better light. But I'm doing this at night in the garage. Um, so, I finished. Well, I didn't finish. But I got all the guts of my Android app working now so that I can receive messages on my iBus and uh, send them out using my Android tablet. I've got, this is my hardware. Here I'm using, this is a yo-yo board. And then this is the uh, iBus transceiver, the MCP2004. Um, I'm not using that XP, that was for debugging. Um, and I'm connected to my Android tablet with USB to the IO, IO, yo-yo. Um, I've got the radio running here. You can see the display is changing. This is the, you know, that extra data that comes over FM. So it knows what station or song that it's playing or whatever. And if this would focus, you can see down at the bottom there. That's not, I can't get it to focus at all. Let's see if I hold it up, if you can tell. It's actually displaying the same text. It's not too interesting, but it's intercepting the messages so that it can display the, the text on there. And uh, I can also, I got this button here, which you can't read either, that sets the mode. So when I hit that, it'll try to switch to CD, hopefully, yeah. And that new CD actually shows up there on the tablet too. And then back to the station it was on. So next up is just to add Ox. That doesn't. Act. Oh, it does show ox. There we go. Um, so the next step is just to uh, add more buttons, and I can have a fully functional radio control on my tablet. And then I can get rid of my radio head unit and just use Android in the car, and you can be able to control everything. So I've got all the plumbing in place now. I just got to figure out the protocol and decipher everything and make it look pretty. Anyway, had a productive weekend.